and Action Pack week began on Monday as we caught up firstly with David Weir for our weekly sit-down. And then we spoke to Kenny Miller for our latest On The Spot feature, which you can read in tomorrow's Queen of the South programme and also watch on Rangers TV. From Auchinhowie, we made a quick dash to Hamden for the Petrofac Cup semi-final draw. Should the Light Blues beat Livingston on Tuesday, they will face St Mirren at Ibrox to fight for a place in the final. Afterwards, we caught up with Jers legend Alex McDonald. On Tuesday, Rangers TV heard all about the Academy's education programme. On Wednesday, Rob and I visited the Ibrox complex for a Rangers soccer school. The duo were extremely generous with their time, signing autographs and chatting to over 70 kids who were present, and we spoke afterwards to Rob Kiernan who looked ahead to the Queen of the South game. Thursday was presser day, and Mark Warburton was thrilled as the club announced the acquisition of Frank McParland from Burnley as the new head of recruitment. Delighted to get someone of Frank's calibre to come to the club, um, recognised as one of the best in the business. Um, his track record speaks for itself, and, and we've worked long and hard, and you know, very thankful to, to the, the board for the support we've got to get some of the fans' calibre to come here, but it's a big step in the right direction for us. And on Friday there was more good news off the field as Craig Flanagan was appointed as the Head of Performance Preparation. You can watch an exclusive interview with Flanagan on Rangers TV tomorrow night. That's all for this week's news wrap. Remember, you can watch tomorrow's game live on Rangers TV if you live outside of the UK and Ireland. And if not, we'll see you again next week.